you guys? How are y'all doing today? I hope you guys are doing so good out there. For today's video, we have our summer fashion finds under $50. For those of you who are new to this series, basically I just like to round up all of my affordable items under 50 bucks and show it to you guys in one lump sum. For today's items, we got a nice mix of like new stuff in addition to some familiar faces. And then I also have like some basic staples in addition to like trendier summer pieces. So I really hope you guys enjoy. As always, everything mentioned or shown in today's video is gonna be down below in the description bar along with the sizing and pricing. I've also included my corresponding blog post at the very top of the box in case you guys want a more enjoyable browsing experience and to also make your viewing experience a lot better I also time stamped every single store so if you guys want to skip around and just check out a few things no problem at all you guys know I go really in deep with all these haul videos so speaking of which too I wanted to get this video out for you guys because the next two weeks are gonna be a Miss Louie annual event if you guys are OG Miss Louie fam you guys know that I've been covering the Nordstrom anniversary sale for many years on this channel and this year is gonna be no different. So just in case you guys are like not interested in any of the Nordstrom stuff, I wanted to be sure you guys had some really cool affordable summer finds. Last but not least, if you guys have not subscribed yet, please be sure to click that red subscribe button down below and join the Miss Louie family. We would love to have you. Grab your snack, grab a drink, get cozy. It is time to get started. All right, you guys. So we're gonna go ahead and get started with the stores with the least amount of items and then move on up. Store number one is going to be Target. All the items I got from Target are gonna be from the Who What Wear line. I love the Who What Wear line for like a mass retailer. The quality and the price, like you just can't beat it. And one of the things I like are gonna be their shirt dresses. This new item is a midi length black and white striped shirt dress. Very similar to this older one that I have with long sleeves, except it's been revamped for the hot summer weather with this nice sleeveless style. Great upscale or work dress that you can wear into the office and then you can also bring a nice cardigan and not have it too bulky whenever it's high AC and then take it off whenever you're outside in the warmer climate. Item number two, this is also a familiar face. I had this in my June outfit of the week video. This is another favorite staple of mine from the Who What Wear line. Absolutely love their button down blouses. This one was a little bit of a different one compared to the other ones I have because this is a collarless version this season. Feels so premium and they really come out with really cool different colors and patterns like this black and orange randomized stripe. If you guys are looking for a really cool button down blouse to add to your work wardrobe, I highly recommend these. And then our third and last item from Target. These are gonna be the Who What Wear Slouchy Bomber Jackets. Love how lightweight these jackets are. I originally bought this black one and featured it in my travel outfits video and I just thought that it was such a cool, drapey, lightweight jacket between that spring and summer weather. So I had to, of course, get this military green color because this is definitely one of my core colors. And I also like that this one has more of like a utilitarian feel. Definitely on the more oversized side, which I really like because you get that slouchy slouchy, effortless feel, but you don't have to deal with the heft of like a heavy duty bomber jacket. Moving on to Windsor, I think this is honestly the first order I think I've placed from their store. Really, really cute, affordable stuff. This one's really quick, I got a pair of shoes and two backpacks to show you guys. For my shoes, I have these adorable pair of pointy-toed, satin, ultra-feminine pair of slide-on mules for only 23 bucks. I think these are so cute with like a little pair of skinny jeans or a little summer dress. If you guys are mules lovers, like I am and want to try something a little bit out of the box and kind of fun and trendy. I think for $23, this was such a great find. And then the other two items that I got from Windsor are going to be these backpacks. I saw these and I was like, dude, that is such a great fashion dupe for the Chloe backpacks. I ended up getting both colors because I couldn't decide. This little baby backpack is so high fashion. You've got these two little zippers on the side if you want to expand it to be a little bit wider. Then to open this guy up, you have a little chain link right here that you need to detach from the central hardware ring. Lift this guy up. You have a little magnetic piece right here so it actually stays shut. Really pretty burgundy lining on the inside. You have a back zipper pocket in addition to two pockets in the front. Also got some little metal feet to protect the bottom. And then the back straps are pretty cool and customizable. You have clasps on each side of the strap so you can do straps on the bottom and then on each side of the bag or you can connect the two into the centralized hook here or you can just do one strap on 
the, each side of the bag and have it as kind of like a side crossbody or shoulder bag. Haven't played around with it too much, but just want to show you guys some different combinations. And then the last detail that's really cool is just like the real Chloe bag. I think they have like real leather in addition to soft suede here. So all of this is like faux leather, but they still try to mimic the textures that you can see in the real bag. So 32 bucks, I get to try out the style without paying thousands of dollars. Moving on to stone number three, let's talk about Everlane. Oh my god, y'all. Quick little backstory. I've actually been interested in shopping from this brand for a long time now. You guys have asked me about it. And crazy, but also very lucky and grateful. Their company actually reached out to me and sent me a few extra items to try out. So I'll definitely let you guys always know what was gifted versus what was purchased, but 90% of it was just all purchased by me. So let's go ahead and get started with my first few items. I have a big stack of t-shirts here. I got four different ones. I got their classic crew neck tee, I've got their U neck tee, their boxy pocket tee, and then also this limited edition scoop neck tee in their heather gray linen material. The things that I like, I love like my deep V neck tees, I like to show a little bit more skin because I've got a very short neck, a big ass head, and also broader shoulders. So I was so thrilled that these crew neck tees cut very flattering and a little bit more feminine on me. So that's the reason why I picked more of their higher neckline tee styles. The fabric is very nice and soft a nice smooth cotton. It's also much, much more lightweight. The colors are amazing. They've got your, of course, hardcore basics because it's more of like a minimalist type of aesthetic, but they also incorporate, you know, things like different stripes. They've also got beautiful, like warm neutrals, like this camel color, and also limited edition materials like this linen. I feel like it strikes a nice balance between being refined enough that you can wear under a blazer and take it to the office, but also it looks just as amazing with like a pair of shorts on a casual summer day. So, so the Everly tees definitely didn't disappoint for me. The crew neck, the scoop neck, and the u-neck I can definitely wear for all occasions all year round. And then I really love the pocket tee one because it's cut more like cropped and boxy. So it feels a little bit more like tomboyish, but it's still cut very flattering and it's just super adorable. All of them were priced between $16 to $20. So right around the same price as like my Top Shop and my Madewell t-shirts. And then the next two items, I've got a tank top and a t-shirt. These I wanted to call out separately because they are a part of of their 100% human line. This one was actually gifted to me, which thank you guys so much, Everlane. You guys did not have to do that. I ended up buying a secondary t-shirt. Proceeds from their 100% human sales go to different types of like charities, associations, and causes. Each different graphic color scheme and design is correlated to a specific campaign. So for instance, this unisex bone and navy colored 100% human tank top, this was a part of their Pride Month collection. So proceeds from the sales of this collection go to the human rights campaign and then proceeds from this one go to Equality Now, which is a part of their women's rights collection. So definitely check out their 100% human page. They've got different charities and different styles for each charity. And I just think it's really cool because I think that the graphic is really sick. Moving on to our next Everlane item. So obviously I love their t-shirts so much. I had to give their t-shirt dresses a try. I got two different colors. I wanted to get one with the pattern and one basic color. This first one is actually part of their limited edition beach collection right now. This one is just a really cool bold navy and white stripe and I really think it's awesome they got this like vertical seam down the center and then the offset the stripe so you get some differentiation there and the material on this one is actually kind of nice and thick if you get out of the water in the swimming pool and you throw this on as a cover-up it'll keep you nice and warm and then the second one I got is a basic heather gray one this one is a little bit different because you actually have a cute little pocket detailing there which is nice because since it's like a solid color you do want something to kind of like break it up super adorable basics you guys you can kick around with some white sneakers in this for like an everyday throw on, don't think about it type of dress. Or you can also turn this into kind of like a business casual outfit with some flats and a blazer. This one was a little bit pricier at $35, more premium material, also limited edition pattern. And then this one was only $25. So for another like five to $10 more in comparison to the t-shirts, you could get a full length dress out of this. And then the last item, you guys, this is another gifted item that I just want to show you guys. If you're looking for a, a massive bag to hold all your essentials, really plain and simple, y'all. This is a very large canvas tote to fit all your beach essentials. You got a cute little pocket here to keep, you know, your cell phone or your wallet separate from all the stuff inside here. And then this guy is dipped in a more heavy duty or protective material. You keep it from getting too dirty on the bottom. I've been using this nonstop whenever I hit the pool or if I'm working upstairs on the rooftop. I'm able to fit like my large beach towel, a change of clothes, water, sunscreen, magazines. $35 a part of their current beach collection. Moving on to store number four, let's talk about Old Navy. First item, a 
favorite staple of mine and you can snatch them up at an insane price. I got all four of these dresses for like $20 or less. I got a tropical bright green like palm print pattern and then I got these three kind of basics here. You guys saw this one in my summer capsule wardrobe. I kind of fell in love with this like organic stamped diamond like tribal print. So I got both the white and the black geometric and then also just this plain solid black one. You can't beat the style of this dress. Like I feel like it's very universally flattering. You got a nice like sweetheart neckline, nipped waist in the center, A-line whoosh of the bottom of the dress. The back is elasticized so in case it's a little bit tight it does stretch with your body. Amazing go-to staple at Old Navy and the great thing is that they switch these colors and patterns out every single season. So if the style looks good on you and you like it you can definitely try out different variations without breaking the bank. For our next two items let's go ahead and stay in the dress department. I picked up these two dresses in their black and white collection. Dress number one is going to be a completely open breezy like free balling type of dress. It's trapeze shape is self tying so you can kind of adjust how high you want that neckline to hit you. And then the last little details you got these cute little tassels on the edges of the ties in addition to some really thick high quality lacing at the bottom. And then dress number two this is another highly rated dress on the site. You have a nice v-neck in the front and also the back. This one's more of just like a simple shift type of dress. And then I think the pattern placement was so smart. I think it's a very slimming dress because you got those vertical lines right here down the body. I got both of these on sale. This one was $30 and this one was $26. I thought it was so cool that they incorporated like playful summer patterns but doing the more like modern minimalist route. And then the last two dresses that I got, this one you guys have already seen. It makes me miss Texas for some reason. I feel like it's such a cutesy like Austin style dress. This is a multi-tiered midi length dress with a nice dramatic ruffle hem at the bottom. I love that the chambray ruffle drapes alongside the chest and then also over your shoulders but you also have the stability of actual spaghetti straps. You can get the look without all the fuss. And then this last one, I didn't think I would be so into this dress so much. It really, it's just a very simple shape. It's an incredibly lightweight fabric which is I think why I really like it. The back is elasticized which is really comfortable. It's not too restricting and tight. It also has, you know, the X shape in the back. And then really the fun thing about this dress is the pattern is like so festive and fun along with this even brighter border at the bottom. This would for sure be like the maxi dress I would bring to like a tropical vacation or like on a cruise ship. Like you get all that full body coverage while still feeling like you're wearing nothing at all. This one is definitely the most like substantial and also the most expensive dress. I like 46 bucks for this one. And then this guy was for 26. And then moving on to tops, I just have two really quick ones I wanted to shout out to you guys. This one you guys have already seen already in my summer capsule wardrobe and also my outfit of the week June. These crochet trim color off the shoulder ruffle tops have been my ultimate favorite in terms of the affordable price range. Like you guys have seen me wear these with joggers, skirts, jeans, obviously a very versatile top and a really great option if you guys are looking to dabble into this popular off the shoulder trend without breaking the bank. Like Old Navy has not only a lot of different styles and colors but they also have really great material and quality. Like seriously I don't think I paid more than like 15 bucks for each of these. And then the second top if you guys are big linen fans like I am got some awesome linen blend tank tops. If linen is a core material that you guys like these are some really great basics and they actually did these really nice and long so you can kind of tuck the front in and let the back hang out for some butt coverage if you guys are into that. Either way I just think these are fantastic quality for less than $10 a piece. And then moving on to bottoms I got a pair of shorts to show you guys. This one has already been seen in my summer capsule wardrobe. I ended up loving these drawstring linen blend shorts so much that I ended up getting it in this pretty little blue color too. Nice wide elasticized waistband, pockets on each side. I like to cuff mine because I want to show a little bit more leg but you can easily uncuff these for a little bit more modesty. For anyone that's not into like denim shorts in the hot summer weather I highly recommend these. Next up and bottoms are some ultra comfortable lightweight joggers. This exact black pair you guys have probably seen a bajillion times. I cannot believe how much black joggers have become such a staple in my wardrobe and because I only have the solid black color 
color, I decided to switch things up. I ended up getting this chevron black and white print. These guys are both a little bit pricier for Old Navy standards. I think these are around like $35 a pair. But if you guys have watched a lot of my fashion videos, you guys see I've definitely gotten my money's worth on these. And last bottoms, you guys, I have three pairs of jeans. Old Navy is one of my favorite affordable sources um, for high quality jeans. Pair number one, you guys have seen this in several of my summer videos. These are gonna be a pair of mid-rise rock stars. And the wash is called Dark Worn. It's deep dark blue wash in addition to some nice fading along the thighs. You got some distressing on both knees, up the thigh, and also some cute little distressing patches along the back pocket. This pair is so kick ass for $32. I would have to say that this is my favorite like fashion dupe for like my AG style jeans. Then pair number two, oh, pair number two. Y'all, I had these in my cart when they first hit the site and then they literally sold out while they were in my cart. And I was so bummed out. But then magically they restocked these and I ended up buying two pairs. I love them so much. You got these massive exposed knee holes that are so big and so distressed. And then the edges of the jeans, they did some raw edging. Like, seriously, so comfortable, you guys. Not only are they super stretchy, those big open knees, like whenever you sit down, it's like you get full like mobility. <laughs> then the last and final pair, you guys, the boyfriend style jeans are also just as amazing as the Rockstar ones. This is a nice light powdery blue wash with some destruction along both of the knees. It's not as super stretchy as the rock stars that I showed you, but it's definitely a more thicker, heavy duty or denim. Super cute, nice summery boyfriend wash. Pick these up for like $35 or less. The last few items that I picked up, you guys have seen me wear the thicker Old Navy hoodies um, earlier in the year. They actually released the exact same style in a super lightweight material for summer. Like you can even see the transparency in the fabric here. Same great slim fit. This one seems to be a little bit longer, which is not a problem for me. Great pockets, contrasting, you know, hoodie ties. I get to have the feeling of the hoodie even during the hotter temperatures in the summer. And last but not least, guys, the final items from Old Navy are going to be purses. Bag number one is a familiar face. This is the tan perforated faux leather tote bag. Perforation adds a little bit of airiness to it. Honestly, what really drew me in were these tassels. This this is the cutest little bag accessory and I'm able to easily take this guy off and put it on different bags if I need a little zhuzh. Now, I would say that this one is not as heavy duty as my street level tote bags. That one has a super thick strap and can handle a lot more weight. So this one I kind of restrict to just everyday light use. And bag number two, I picked this one up because I thought it was a great faux leather um, fashion dupe for the really popular Madewell leather totes. This one's got the same short handle here for your hands, a nice zippered top and then also just like a perfectly like small medium square style in addition to a crossbody shoulder strap. This is such a great like basic everyday bag with some decent security. I'm able to fit my full size wallet here. If y'all like that bag and don't want to spend that much, this one is a fabulous duplicate. And last but not least, I got this adorable little summer clutch. If you guys are looking for that nice like natural material with all the fun like fringe and tassel detailing, this guy was only $20 and I really like the fact that it's black and white so it still matches with a lot of different things and then the back gives you a nice sturdy faux leather base so it's not super flimsy like it's pretty substantial it's the perfect size and it's really cute to kind of zhuzh up your outfit if you're going out on a date night in the summertime all right you guys in our last store of the day going to be shein.com this haul is less about basics and more about like fun little summer pieces to wear for the season and all of them were really affordable between like 10 and like 25 dollars max i was going to start with a tops the first two are gonna be kind of similar in style they're both short sleeve button down blouses that are loose and breezy and really great for like really hot humid days top number one is going to be kind of like a semi sheer lightweight white blouse this one is collarless this one features just really cute little blue and orange embroidered flowers all throughout the front and this guy comes in four I believe other styles that are all bright floral embroidery so definitely check those out and the top number two is a striped system it's actually collarless it's got a little pocket, same cuffed short sleeve with a little tab on the side. And then at the hem, you'll see that this is a self-tying front, so you can tie this off into a cute little knot. It creates a nice little like gathered hem at the bottom. These shirts were both super affordable at $11 and $12. Top number three, another great option if you're looking for just like a really loose, breezy summer top. This one drew me in because of the pattern. It was so like bright and happy. I love like the watercolor look of the flowers. Very oversized, super loose 
smooth and breezy, like food baby approved. And it's almost got like a baby doll, like peplum style with this big dramatic, you know, ruffle hem on the bottom. Super cute, $11. Top number four, this one is completely different than the other three. This is like an off the shoulder statement sleeve, keyhole, cross neck, halter top. <laughs> it was 14 bucks, so I was like, hey, I'll give it a shot. I thought it ended up looking really cute, tucked into like a high-waisted um, pair of shorts or a skirt. Super cute for a barbecue picnic club scene. <laughs> Now moving into our dress section, as you can see, I went pretty ham. Dress number one, like seriously, like this is one of those dresses, like if I was a dress, I would be this dress. <laughs> Pattern has all these like vintagey rose flower clusters all over it that really complement that warm nude color. You have these ruffles crossing over on this neckline and then also um, cascading down the center of the dress and then on the bottom. I just think it gives such like a sexy but romantic type of feel. Then dress number two and three, these are gonna be the battle of the blue stripe dresses. Both of these dresses were super popular on the site, so I thought I'd give both of them a try. This first one is gonna be the longer length one. This is an apron style dress. It connects in the back on either side of the waistline, and then you also got some pockets, which is always the cutest detail. So this dress may seem simple, but it's very sexy, and the one thing I will say about this dress is that it has some side boob action, like Peter Griffin side boob action. Like I definitely just went with some silicone um, nipple petals just to cover up the chocolate chips. I only have 32 C's, so I'm not working with a lot here. So they weren't spilling out too, too much, but I just want to give you guys the full disclosure before you consider this dress. And then dress number two, this one is going to be a shorter length version. I really got drawn to this dress because you guys have seen this style in a lot of the dresses that I picked out for myself this summer. You've got this cutout right here in the center of the stomach, and then the actual breast coverage is a self-tying contraption here. And then you've got these buttons that go down the center. Then the back bodice is all elastic. Two really cute variations on the same awesome summery print. This longer apron style dress was a little bit pricier at $21. And then this um, shorter style was $19. Moving on to our next dress. This is probably something I'll wear closer to the fall time, but the red checkered is also kind of a summery print. So I thought I'd show you guys. This one legit is like a baby doll dress. I also love it. This one is a crew neck, three quarter sleeve, ruffled swing shape dress. Because the sleeves are a little bit longer, I probably wouldn't wear this on a super hot day. If you're into this style, this could be a pretty cool summer to fall dress. Like you could throw on a denim jacket, different pieces of outerwear, some ankle boots, and it can transition well into that fall weather. And our next two dresses are going to be maxi style dresses for those of you who really aren't into shorter hemlines. First one up is going to be this beautiful dark navy bird print wrap style maxi dress. I love wrap style dresses. Really accentuate that nice waist. They're so universally flattering and I feel like the wrap style in addition to the length kind of adds a little bit of elegance to it. And then in contrast our second maxi dress. This one is very like bohemian style. This one is an off the shoulder type of dress. You actually have an elasticized neckline and then the self tying feature right in the center that creates this little keyhole. You can actually adjust how wide and tight you want the neckline to be. And then the actual waistline. This this one is not elasticized, so you kind of have to scrunch the fabric, tie it off, almost like a drawstring backpack. Really cool maxi dress finds. I love both of them. I honestly am getting kind of like anthropology vibes from them since they're really bright colored and there's some like type of whimsy to them because you're paying like literally a fraction of the price for them. These are definitely more premium on the Shein side for $25 and $21. All right guys, and then the last dress. I've been really loving this trend this season, this blue stripe with the really fun um, bright floral embroidery on top. I wore a similar shirt to this in my Chic Wish lookbook, and I like that shirt so much, I wanted to get a dress version, something that I could just button up and go out the door with some flats during the summertime. I also like that this one was actually short sleeve instead of a long sleeve shirt. And I just really love that oversized shirt feel. Now, this one ended up being a lot cheaper at only $17. Last thing I will say is that I am 5'2", and I think it hits perfectly where I want it to lengthwise, but if you guys are taller than me, I think that you might need to wear this as an 
oversized shirt. And the next two items are gonna be some fun rompers. Romper number one, I guess I'm in some sort of like navy bird theme this season, but the actual shape of this romper, I just really, really love. You have these nice billowy flutter sleeves, a nice deep V-neck in the center, attached belt so that you can really nip the waist as tight as you want it, and then the actual shorts itself are high volume flared shorts. So it really creates that nice hourglass shape. And the rubber number two, the actual shorts are hidden underneath the dress, so you kind of hop in to the short section, you zip it up, and then this front panel goes across the body and then you seal it off right here. So the outer shell of the romper is an actual full dress and then you have those matching shorts hidden underneath for, you know, just <laughs> making sure you ain't showing your panties off. <laughs> this guy I think was the most expensive item out of this haul at $26 and then the navy feather one was $17. Last item today, you guys. I feel like this set is on like every single like Shein type of site so I thought I'd give it a try because it's still got really, really great reviews for 18 bucks, you get both the short sleeve crop top and the matching shorts, and together they really coordinate nicely into one beautiful like masterpiece. It really reminds me of those beautiful like ornate um, white and blue porcelain vases. Really happy with this purchase. The only thing I will say, this fabric is a little bit on the thicker side. This is not like a thin, breathable summer fabric, so just please keep that in mind if you're considering this matching set. All right, you guys, congratulations for surviving our summer affordable finds haul. I hope you guys really enjoyed. Again, everything mentioned in today's video, along with sizing, pricing, and timestamps, are gonna be down below in the description box. I want to sincerely thank you guys for hanging out with me today. We have a pretty intense next two weeks with the Nordstrom anniversary sale, so I hope you guys are prepared for that. <laughs> I hope you guys are having an amazing summer. I'm just sending you all my love all the time. You guys have a good one, and I'll see you guys in a few days. Bye!